What's up, Pisces? It's your girl Isabella Tara Tarot back at it again. I'm just going to hit y'all with y'all's July message. Um, we're going to see what spirit comes through with. But go ahead and hit the thumbs up button. And, you know, go check out my Etsy page. I've got all kinds of spiritual supplies. I've got my little mala beads on today. Um, I'm also, you know, selling those on my Etsy site. But, so, your song was drake too good i'm really feeling like somebody's feeling really unappreciated in a situation in a partnership somebody feels like they've been putting in way too much effort time energy into something that's not like i'm too good for you i'm way too good for you you take my love for granted i just don't understand it like rihanna and drake i'm i'm saying and the cards that came out with conflict and defeat and move on and what's not seen is patience and planning like okay if this isn't you the person that you're dealing with this can go two ways all right so this is either you or the person you're dealing with what was that beeping anyway so this is either you or the person you're dealing with like I believe y'all have had some kind of fallout there's some fallouts taking place between you and the person you're dealing with and like somebody's really thinking about moving on because they're feeling unappreciated like unappreciated they they feel like they're putting way too much in in this relationship or whatever you got going on to the point where it's like they're thinking more long term they're thinking how long can i put up with this or you're thinking how long can i put up with this like how long am i really going to continue to oh hold on one second i'm in the process of recording <sighs> okay hold on one second i'll let my husband out Don't need any water huh? mm, Sorry about that. Let's go ahead and get back into the message, though. All right, somebody's feeling unappreciated and is really thinking long and hard about their long term like somebody's possibly thinking divorce if you're like if for those of you who are married somebody's thinking divorce somebody's thinking like really getting up out of a situation because they don't feel appreciated they feel like they're putting in way too much and getting way too little moving on conflict conflict in the feet along with patience and planning what's not seen is patience and planning like somebody could be spending way too much time focusing on you know their work their career legal situations to where they're not focusing on what's going on at home okay we're gonna get in here and see what this is about because now I'm curious what does the Pisces need to know about the situation? What does the Pisces need to know about the situation? July. June 20. Not June 20. July. July. Pisces. For the fact that I said June, I feel like something went down in June or some conversations happened in June that really got to thinking. <clears throat> Your son is watched over and protected as he explores his world along with dietary change, improving your diet, and your life will also improve. Every time I get that card, 
was not seen as admit your true feelings to yourself. Be honest with yourself. Only you know what it is that you truly desire. I hope my voice doesn't go out. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Somebody's really thinking about leaving a partnership. For some of you, y'all are in a relationship with someone who has, you know, um, I feel like they have this child in your in this relationship and I feel like this child is becoming too much this child is becoming too much to the point where you're wanting to de detoxify your energies of this child this won't be for all of you but this is for some of you like every time I get dietary change it's like talking about detox and getting something out of your environment something is toxic something is toxic whether you know I'm not saying that this child was toxic but um, for some of you I don't know you know I don't know the age range on this because it's like this could be for anybody but I feel like there's something going on in a family situation that's just, it's just toxic. And it's got, it's dealing with it, you know, possibly dealing with a child. And someone's having to get clear on what they want. What they want for their future, what they want for their long term. Because admit your true feelings to yourself, be honest with yourself, only you know what it is that you truly desire. This is somebody, what's not seen is somebody is getting their solar plexus chakra, you know, under control. Somebody's really, really focusing on what it is that they want, what they truly want in life. And they might be in a partnership, you know, with this. This fa something about this family dynamic is off, okay? And I feel like it's really causing a lot of turmoil and conflict for some of you. Ugh. Why did this go like this? July? For those of you who aren't dealing with, you know, to a toxic, you know, possibly stepchild or child what have you the other for those of you who aren't dealing with that you're dealing with a legal situation what's not seen is like having patience with a legal situation and it's like moving on conflict and defeat this could be dealing with a divorce and really like running away from a situation stepping out of a partnership really ending something um in, Ju in July like something is coming to an end for some of you in July in regards to a court case something getting settled like somebody like really running away from possible obligations to their son somebody is like dipping on a child detoxifying energies and mature tree somebody's getting getting clear on what they want in life and they realize they don't want to be a parent they don't want to be a parent and they're moving on they're they're basically running away from their responsibilities in July somebody is running away from responsibilities in July is really what I'm getting really strong for the Pisces I don't know who this is in your life do not shoot the messenger I just be getting what they give me shit anyway let's see what the energy for Pisces is gonna be Okay, sacral chakra for the Pisces. Power and harmony. What's going on in your solid relationship? Like, there's one relationship in the center of everything, okay? And it's really solid. Like, power, harmony, and underneath it all, sacral chakra. There's going to be a lot of um, hooking up going on for you in July um, with you and your significant other. Okay, so if you possibly have a child with you know someone else and you're in a partnership like a solid partnership this is the message for you guys 
what I'm getting is the person that you're actually in the solid partnership with like that partnership is so strong and so good and like this person loves you with all of their heart they want growth with you they want to give you the world your heart chakra might not be like their heart chakra is completely aligned whoever this is that you're dealing with and they only have eyes for you this may be a partnership from the past is kind of what I'm hearing a partnership from the past but they they've been without you before and they don't want to be without you again they want to go above and beyond to prove to you that they are, can be a provider or that they are a provider or that they want to be the main provider this is a very strong individual very masculine energy is what I'm getting here very mature very mature masculine energy their heart chakra is like in complete alignment and they want to they want to be the rock they want to be your rock is what I'm hearing and they are so sexually attracted to you that um, they couldn't leave if they wanted to because it's, like, it's almost like the energies are merged. Whoever this main partnership is, the energies are merged. You are one. They couldn't leave if they wanted to. But um, that's, that's for the main partnership. But this outside partnership, I really feel like, I feel like somebody might have tried to start some situations like some kind of conflict someone tried someone wanted for your partnership to fail they really wanted it to fail and I feel like it was like somebody that you've you've had a child with but July the energy is completely airing itself out like this person is running away because it's like they've lost they've lost the war they're moving on they're leaving it alone they're leaving it alone because they know that they cannot win I feel like you've gotten you've gotten clear on what it is that you want and this energy shift has really I feel like this energy shift in you realizing that you know this partnership is for you it's all like he, this person who you're dealing with is all about you you've gotten clear on that and because you are you know moving into this energy you are releasing can I pick it up you're releasing this this other end this other individual this third party this person that you might have possibly had a child with like you're finally moving on from that situation um, you're clearing that energy out of your life and you're moving into something more solid and something more stable a better environment for your child purified you know inner you're cleansing um, a very toxic energy out of your life in July okay Move that on up and out. Let's see what's going on for the Pisces in their career in July. Spiritual teacher, your life purpose involves teaching others about healing and spirituality. Along with, oh yes, this is the card that you always want to see. What's not seen, business ventures. Trust and follow through on a new business idea or career opportunities. Okay. You are supposed to be trusting your intuition right now, is what I'm getting. You're coming into a very prosperous time in July. Like, if you were having any kind of financial issues in June, they're all going to be resolved in July. It's a very fertile and abundant energy that you're coming into in July. I almost feel like surprise money is coming in for you. For, for some of you, there is going to be surprise money coming in. Or money that you just you didn't you didn't expect to come in. You're finally in this energy of just waiting 
and allowing whatever comes to you to come to you. And because you have released the... word that yeah how you have re you've released the need to or the feeling of lack you you've released any feeling of lack and because you've just released it and you know you basically come into the energy of what what comes to me comes to me and I'm gonna be fine regardless okay because you've come into this energy this abundant energy abundance is coming to you Money is going to be, I feel like it's going to be flowing like it hasn't ever flown before. Or it's just, it, it's just going to be, flow, it's like money abundance is flowing to you in July. And I feel like something's going to happen in July that's going to shock you in regards to finances, but it's going to be a good shock, okay? Something really positive is about to happen for you in July in regards to your finances, and it's something that you, I feel like you might have had, you know, maybe a few thoughts in the past of something that could have possibly popped up, but you, you'd let it go. You weren't really, you weren't sitting there thinking about it. You're just sitting in a more comfortable energy, not really feeling like you need to push for anything, just allowing whatever comes to you to come to you and then because you do that it like blows in like crazy in July some of you may be some of you may have taken a new for those of you who have taken a new um, career it's gonna be incredibly prosperous some of you may have stepped into, you know, spiritual teachings and or the occult or, you know, metaphysical practices or something that may be considered a little taboo to the closed minded individuals, you know, but you I feel like you don't care anymore. You're <laughs> some of you Pisces are coming out, okay? But you're coming out in a way that it's a you're coming out in a gentle way, but it's allowing so much prosperity to flow into you that it's like a freaking blessing. Some major financial blessing is coming to the Pisces in July. It's really what I'm getting for you guys. And all this purple, like in July your intuition is gonna be on point. On point you're gonna be in a very calm energy like your your energy in regards to money is just calm in July and because you're in this such a calm state look I feel the calm I, I feel I feel it you're in such a calm state that it's just drawing it's attracting you're attracting so much because you're in this calm state yes take that are there any other messages for the Pisces for July holiday the answer you're looking for can be found during a vacation retreat or holiday getaway along with your desire is within reach. Have faith as everything is working out in your favor. Message from Spirit. Enjoy where you are right now. Even if you don't have much in the right now. Because with you enjoying where you are. You're attracting so much more like everything that you've wanted is about to not just be within reach it's going to be here everything that you've been waiting on like some of you may have been manifesting things in the past and you were just sitting there waiting and waiting and waiting like when is this going to happen today tomorrow next week 
two weeks from now, when is it going to happen? Because you are, you've stopped worrying about when, the when, everything that you have wanted previously, everything that you have tried to manifest in the past is now here, July. It's here. There's no more waiting. And I feel like it's like, it's gonna feel you're gonna feel so blessed in the month of July that I, I don't feel like anybody's gonna be able to rain on your parade, even if you were like you know. It doesn't matter what the day looks like if you were in like this, you know, it, it's raining, it's mucky, you're in you're in a swamp area. It doesn't even matter. You're still going to be you know. In this very positive happy energy because of everything that is being presented to you like nothing can rain on your parade in um in July it just really feels like that's gonna be a time where I mean some of you will be traveling but it's there won't be anything for you to worry about in July if you've been you know stressed out in June or the months before all of that has cleared it's it's clearing out and you're being allowed to step into a bright new future a new beginning you're being able to leave the negative energies behind and move into your bliss anyways thank you guys for watching don't forget to like subscribe hit the notification button and check out my Etsy page my spiritual shop, Isabella Tara. Nope, not Isabella. Izzy Tara Tarot on Etsy. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Bye.